A major step is being taken to help track coronavirus cases in L.A. County. Now, anyone showing symptoms can apply to get tested. CBS News' Cara Finstrom is in the Westlake District with how to apply and how one medical center is reopening. Next week, the St. Vincent Medical Center, which went into bankruptcy and has been sitting here empty for months, will reopen. Its mission? To treat an expected surge in coronavirus patients. This morning, crews are getting this hospital ready for check-in. The St. Vincent will provide 266 beds and expand the state's ICU capacity. Its sole mission will be to take transfer patients from other overloaded facilities. Since the hospital's owner, Verity Health, took it into bankruptcy in 2018, a number of entities have looked into purchasing it. Now the state will instead lease it. And executives and medical officers with Dignity Health and Kaiser will run it. The good news is state leaders continue creating more beds statewide is California has ventilators. In fact, Governor Gavin Newsom says we have more than enough right now, 11,000. So the state is sending 500 to FEMA to help hard hit communities like New York City. Meanwhile, L.A. County just reached a crucial milestone for COVID-19 testing. Anybody who wants to get a test can apply for that test. So there are no longer any limits. Now, that doesn't mean we'll have a test for everybody tomorrow. Mayor Eric Garcetti says there are now enough kits to open up testing to anyone experiencing symptoms, though priority will still go to folks who have underlying health conditions or are 65 and older. Any county resident can schedule the test through an online portal. The county program, which started two weeks ago with a single drive through site, has grown to 13 different testing locations. By week's end, the mayor expects a total of 30,000 tests to be complete. From the Westlake District, Cara Finstrom, CBS 2 News.